Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Wendy. Yes, it has been a while. Just here to do a chit chat. If you'd like to hear what I have to say, then do please stay tuned. So this is going to be a chit chat to update you on why I haven't been on late, as of late. And, um, on Monty and on our home and uh, several different things. So number one, I've been sick as a dog, um, but I'm feeling better. I'm getting my strength back, and so it's time to continue my channel. Um, I hadn't, I haven't answered my last comments. I'm going to do that as soon as I finish posting this video, and um, I'm beginning to get my strength back. Um, as for our home, you know the old saying, when it rains, it pours. Well, that is true. Last week, we had a hailstorm here in Alabama. It was about golf ball size, uh, hail. And, you know, we, we checked the vehicles and everything, and everything seemed to be fine. Okay, so, um... A lot of schools and businesses were closed today in Alabama because of increment weather. So it came a monsoon this morning. Well, needless to say, our skylight got cracked last week, so it started pouring water into it today. All over the frame part of my garden tub, um, you know, our garden tub has carpeting on the steps and um, a platform around the tub and the wood up at the skylight has started to buckle in the corner and um, that wood and carpet is wet around the garden tub now and I've got a shop vac I'm going to try and vacuum up as much of it as I can and um, put some towels down and try and soak up the rest and see if I can't keep that from molding back there so when it rains sometimes it does pour um, Monty. Monty has been, um, a joy, but Monty has had a lot of things wrong with him, and the vet says that most everything that was wrong with Monty was from being at the Humane Society. Monty is the first animal I ever got from the Humane Society. Um, we rescued Callie from Petco for free from a worker there. We got our Mr. Snuggles that passed away from uh, my son brought him home to us because somebody had pulled all of his eyebrows and his whiskers out. He had none. He was being abused, so my son brought him home, and we raised him till he passed. And then Sebastian was here underneath our mobile home when we moved in here. Well, he was under the shed, and then his mom moved him. So all of our animals and, you know, Monk Monk came out of Sebastian's mouth. All of my animals are rescue animals. I just, um, I like it that way. But Monty is the first one we got from the Humane Society. So he has several things wrong with him from being there amongst all the other um, kitty cats. I have to take this. Hold on. Just Sorry about that. So Monty has had an eye infection. Of the secondary lid, cats have two sets of eyelids. They have an internal set and an external set. He has had herpes of his right eye. He has had an upper respiratory, uh, something or another. He has had allergies. The allergies is the only thing that you can't attribute to being at the Humane Society. And then he had round worms, which are quite common in cats. But they're more apt to get them if they're around other cats because they pick them up through the soles of their feet. Um, Callie has never had round worms and neither has Sebastian. Um, I think my Mr. Snuggles did have round worms and we had to treat him. So I'm still treating uh, Monty for round worms. But he is one of the sweetest kitty cats I have ever met. When you pet him, he doesn't try to claw you or latch on or anything like that. Now, when he plays, he does put his claws out. Um, he 
absolutely is adorable. I can be in the bathroom putting my makeup on and he'll come in there and get up on the counter and put both of his feet up on my chest and just rub his little face on my chin. I've never had a cat to do that. He is very appreciative of having a good home and a lot of love. And he and Sebastian are best buds now, and that's exactly what I was hoping for. That's why I got Monty. Because Callie is 14, Sebastian is 2, and Callie just was not um, very nice to Sebastian most of the time because she's old and grumpy. And um, so Sebastian and Monty play all of the time, and I am very, very pleased with that. It just makes me smile to think about it. Um, we watch them play all of the time, my husband and I do, and know that we made the right decision in um, adopting a buddy for Sebastian so he would have one of his own kind around, close to his age, that he could play with. Um, Monty is growing like a weed, even though he has had health problems, and his, and, uh, his allergies or most likely seasonal allergies, so he'll have to take his Zyrtec, you know, um, in the spring and in the fall or when the pollen is high. Um, but it has been a joy taking care of him, except for him pooping all over the house because he's had the runs from where I've been worming him. But hey, it's almost past. Um, that has almost passed, and, you know, it just makes my stomach stronger. Um, let's see what else. Oh, I've had to work on my car again. Um, my sensor to my camshaft that I replaced about six months ago went bad again. And they tell me at the auto parts store that where they place that sensor on the motor, it catches a lot of heat. Um, it's at the top of the motor, and it fouls out because it gets overheated. But there's no way to keep it cool because of where it's at. So, um, um, I replaced that, and obviously I got a bad one because it kept throwing out the code even after I just put it on. So, I carried that one back to uh, O'Reilly's and got another one and put it on my car, and so far, so good. Um, my positive battery cable is overheating, so I've got to change it out, which it's... It's no problem. It comes from the starter up to the battery. You unbolt it. You unbolt it at both ends. I have ramps to drive my car up on. So um, that will be pretty easy to take care of. I'm going to take care of that tomorrow. We're having a monsoon today. Um, so that's about it. Um, still loving my wig that Linda sent me. It's very natural. I love it. Um, I have been wearing my other ones too, but this one is the one that I grab most of all right now. Um, and Linda is a sweetheart. She's been very busy lately and I've been very busy. So, you know, we've only been talking once or twice a day, whereas we were talking several times a day. But, you know, life happens. Life happens and you get caught up in it and, um, you just have to carry on. So... I have really been enjoying all the Japanese snacks that she sent to me in her last gift package. The yin yans, the chocolate yin yans are to die for. I love those things. They're like a they're like a crispy breadstick cookie that you dip down in icing. Um, like the, the um dipsticks. The powder dipsticks that you lick the little dipstick and stick it down in the powder. Well this is the same uh technique pretty much, but it's icing and little cookie sticks. I really, really like those. And then she sent me a dessert called Moochie. And she advised me to put mine in the refrigerator to give it a little bit of texture. I like those a lot. So thank you very much, Linda, for my snacks. I've really been enjoying them and my coffee drinks. Um, she's so sweet to me. And um, she's one of a kind. I'm very blessed to have her in my life. Um, I am a blessed individual. I know that every day, and I thank God for the blessings in my life every day. Everybody be safe, be kind to one another, and I will see you with a regular video next. <laughs>